What happened when the U.S. president met his Chinese counterpart? The two leaders met on the sidelines of APEC summit, the power tussle between the two nations, who have spent years imposing sanctions on each other, was on full display. Now let us get you the moments which made the headlines. From sharing important discussions on military cooperation to photo ops, moments from the meeting of both leaders have taken the internet by storm. At the summit, U.S. Secretary of State Antony Blinken kept his gaze focused on President Joe Biden when the latter first addressed China's president at the table. Now, this was when Biden said that the two nations might not have seen eye to eye on various issues, but have always spoken to each other in a candid manner. It does not be in the conflict. And we also have to manage it responsibly. Now, one of the most viral moments was when America's top diplomat flinched with a disapproving nod when the U.S. president went a little off script and described his Chinese counterpart as a dictator. This video has gone viral on the Internet. The Russian deputy U.N. ambassador also took a pot shot. After four-hour talks which aimed to prevent growing tensions between the world's largest economies, the two world leaders got into a candid chat about presidential cars. The U.S. president peeked inside Xi Jinping's limo and then gestured to his own car, calling his vehicle the Beast. They call it the Beast. <laughs>